So welcome back to a new episode of the Aquaponics Judo and today I'm going to cut away some plants to get some um, better nutrition flow to useful plants now. So I want to show you this is like, a, it's like how nice clean those roots are now with this, uh, with this swirl filter. This is ideal. It's amazing. Have to shake out some, some stones out of it. That should be okay. Oh, there's a spider over there. Uh, anyway, so these plants go back into the worm uh, dispensary. And I will cut it up, small pieces. And before that, I had cleaned up this bucket because it was not so going, uh, going so well. A lot of dry stuff on top of it. And underneath there was a layer of, of the worms, so I'm just putting a nice fresh layer of greens on top of it so they will uh, eat faster, produce faster, and because uh, this thingy was not going. So, and also I put some worm casting into the system uh, with worms also, so it's like a plus plus situation for this grow box again, and it's a little bit cleaner again. So, I think this tomato will compete with this potato, potato tomato, you can also combine them to make a tomato potato, maybe we can do that in the future or later by grafting it as I call as I renounce it, so, yeah, it seems to be that he's a, he's a tough guy, <laughs> are you gonna escape from there? Snail. I was thinking about uh, cooking snails and feeding uh, them like fish food, but it's not an animal friendly way. But it is a creature with uh, all the organs in it heart, liver, kidneys, brain, stuff like that. So it should be good food. But boiling snails? Hmm. What's your opinion about boiling snails? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> use them as fish food. And the shells also kind of be pH buffer if you were. Uh, and it's also good uh, flow of calcium I think. Like I need need their hive snails, uh, snail shells. They are slowly dissolving. So could be a win-win situation. Snail use snails as a kind of food for your fish. Losing his eye in 10 seconds. Or so. He's going down. <laughs> what a weird guy. I cannot die. Oh, watch out. Danger, I think. We got away. <laughs> Out of here. <laughs> so, anyway, let's uh, cut up some mint and some other plants so we have more nutrition for the other plants. Chop it up. Welcome back to a new episode of the Popping's Udam. And today, a long item that was on the wish list. It's like bloody hot over here. But today, it's like uh, 26, 42 degrees. But anyway, I made a contraption that is. Um, the thingy is that you can uh, learn fish to feed themselves 
So I made this uh, contraption a little bit with Lego and put a little bit of cable over there that will simulate the menu feed button with a little push button over there. So the trick is to learn the fish to push that white thing there with a force. So maybe I just drop in a little bit piece by piece some small food. Maybe hopefully they touch it like that and oh, almost. <laughs> And then hopefully they will remember that and they will uh, learn themselves to feed. Learn themselves to feed. So let's conditionize these fish. They only need to pressure them. And maybe we can get it on video. Maybe it will take weeks or months. Yeah. A little bit more. So what they would do? Oh, almost. And then the fun part is uh, they did a study in the university with uh, catfish, and the thing was if they can uh, feed themselves when they are feeling hungry. You can push a button and they get fruit, so their digestion system is not on a pause in that way that the growth process can also continue, so fish might grow 30% faster when they learn to feed themselves, so it's the thing uh, we're trying to achieve here. Just let it autumn or almost <laughs> Do it again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, baby. Push it, push it, yeah. Yeah, push it. Come oh. <laughs> on, bash it. Almost, yeah. So that's the thing. I hope they will remember that. When they're hungry to swirl around. And one will when one will learn it, I think the others will follow. They will uh, learn that this thing is quite attractive. <laughs> Long run. Put a little white collar on it so maybe you can remember that uh, spot and if they might be colorblind they can recognize it still. See what they will do in 
the long run, now they will grow, it will work. I'm doing them. I go fishing is stupid.